Hey what is guys today I'm going to be showing you how you can make a Suicide Squad inspired text effect in Photoshop like the one you're seeing on screen. This is inspired from the effect using the Suicide Squad trailers and other things related to the film's marketing. Now this is not exactly identical to the original but like I said it's inspired not copied. Before I begin I would like to say that you will need Photoshop CS6 or above to follow along with this tutorial. So let's head on over to Photoshop and see how this is made. First we're going to create our new document which is going to be 1920 by 1080 in my case. After that write your text one layer at a time and then align the text layers. As you can see my text is a bit too small so I'm going to increase the size of it by pressing command and control T. After you're done with the text layer select the first text layer and go up to the 3D menu and select new 3D extrusion. This will convert your workspace into the 3D workspace. Now you have to repeat this step for each of the text layers. After all this, select all the new 3D text layers and once again, go up to the 3D menu and select Merge 3D Layers. Now you're going to adjust the position of each of the letters with different rotational values. Do this for all of the other text layers. Select the infinite light object in the 3D panel and adjust the smaller handle of the on-screen tool to adjust the angle of the scene lighting to provide more contrast between the front face and the side faces. Next, click the uppermost layer that contains the words inflation material in the 3D window, then shift click the very last layer. Under the properties panel, select a steel metal preset. After that, you have to get a cracked concrete texture from online. I'm going to leave this one in the description down below. After getting the texture, open the image in Photoshop and desaturate it. To do this, go up to the image, adjustment and desaturate. Then save it for web as a JPEG. Go to the diffusion menu and replace or load the new texture that we just desaturated. Then all you have to do is select the rectangular marquee tool and select the text part and go up to the 3D menu and click on render. After rendering is complete, you have to get a cosmic space image. Again, I'm gonna leave this one in the description down below. After getting the image, drag it on top of the 3D text layer that we created and resize it if you have to. Then set the blend mode to overlay and there you go. You can move the image around to see where it fits best. So that was my tutorial on how to create a Suicide Squad inspired text effect. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this one. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys very soon.